Explore the world's most secretive U.S. military bases now? The United States not only has impressive aircraft, powerful aircraft carriers, devastating artillery weapons, and an inexhaustible arsenal. The true key to its global military dominance lies in its ability to act in any corner of the planet at any time. This is made possible by its vast network of strategically distributed military bases. In 2024, it is estimated that the U.S. operates around 750 bases abroad, spread across more than 80 countries, from the deserts of Africa to the icy continent of Antarctica. To put it into perspective, between 70% and 85% of all military bases outside U.S. borders belong to the U.S., giving it a global reach no other country can match. But this military power is not without controversy. Many of these bases, far from being mere defensive centers, have sparked local tensions, mass protests, and even diplomatic conflicts. Some harbor secrets so dark that they have captured the attention of the entire world. In this video, we will take you on a tour of the 10 most controversial U.S. military bases in the world, revealing surprising stories and the reasons behind their controversial reputations. Are you ready to discover what few dare to tell? Intrepidos time travelers, join us on this journey to the epicenter of global military power. Before diving into the most controversial bases, let's clarify something important. Not all U.S. military bases are the same. They are divided into two main categories. One, lily pads or cooperative security locations. These are the smallest and most discreet. They generally house fewer than 200 personnel, are usually temporary and have a low profile, designed for specific operations without drawing too much attention. Two, mega bases. On the other end are the giants. These facilities can house from hundreds to tens of thousands of soldiers and in some cases, function as entire cities abroad. Some islands are even dedicated exclusively to operating as U.S. military bases. While it is estimated that around 750 U.S. bases exist abroad, this number is not fixed. Some are built, others are closed or relocated constantly. And here's the interesting part. Many of these bases are ultra-secret to the point that, according to various sources, even the Pentagon does not have an accurate record of the exact number of operational bases. This veil of mystery, combined with their global presence, makes U.S. military power as impressive as it is controversial. What secrets lie behind these installations? Prepare to uncover them in this tour of the most controversial bases on the planet. Ramstein, the military giant of Europe. We begin our tour in Germany, the country with the most U.S. bases in the world, a legacy of World War II and the Cold War. Among them stands Ramstein Air Base located in Rhineland Palatinate. Ramstein is not just a base, it is the headquarters of the U.S. Air Force in Europe and the epicenter of a vast military complex that houses 16,000 U.S. soldiers and over 5,400 civilian employees. Close by is the Landstuhl Regional Medical Center the largest U.S. military hospital outside its territory. The ongoing controversy. While Ramstein represents a strategic point for the U.S., its use has sparked numerous criticisms. Logistics center of war. The base has been used to transport weapons and ammunition to Syrian rebels during the civil war, without the approval of the German government. Drone operations. Ramstein has played a key role in drone strikes in Afghanistan, Pakistan, Yemen, and Somalia, carried out without Germany's authorization, diplomatic tensions. Despite Berlin's complaints, bilateral agreements signed after World War II give the U.S. full jurisdiction over Ramstein, limiting the German government's ability to intervene. The friction between the two countries has grown, with local protests and complaints from the families of victims affected by these attacks. How can a base in Allied territory cause so much conflict? Aviano Air Base, Italy. Located in northern Italy, Aviano is home to the 31st Fighter Wing, one of the U.S. quote, S main air combat units in Europe. What makes this base particularly controversial is its role as a nuclear weapons storage site in underground systems. The Abu Omar case in 2003, the base was key in the abduction of Egyptian cleric Abu Omar, who was transferred from Milan to Egypt, where he was imprisoned and tortured. In 2013, 26 CIA agents were convicted for this case but were never extradited. During the Benghazi embassy attack in 2012, 
Aviano was mentioned as a possible air support base, though no aircraft were deployed. Bases in Okinawa, Japan Okinawa, although it represents only 0.6% of Japan's territory, houses 62% of the U.S. bases in Japan. With more than 30,000 soldiers deployed, it is a critical point in Asia due to its proximity to China and North Korea. Social conflicts economic development limitation due to the occupation of 25% of the island. Allegations of serious crimes. There have been reports of serious crimes committed by U.S. soldiers. Environmental issues. In 2021, contamination of the drinking water supply for 450,000 residents was discovered due to military activities. Ramstein Air Base, Germany. With 16,000 soldiers and the largest U.S. military hospital outside the U.S., Ramstein serves as the headquarters of the Air Force in Europe. War logistics, used to transport weapons to Syria and coordinate drone strikes in Afghanistan, Yemen and Somalia without German government authorization. Diplomatic tensions. U.S. full jurisdiction over the base limits Germany's ability to intervene, generating tensions. Camp Humphreys, South Korea. It is the largest U.S. military base in the world, with a cost of $11 billion and capacity for 35,000 soldiers and their families. Social controversies. In 2002, a U.S. military vehicle struck and killed two South Korean teenagers. The absolution of the responsible parties sparked massive protests. Despite the tensions, the base is crucial for deterring threats from North Korea. al Udid Air Base, Qatar Built in 1996, it is the largest U.S. base in the Middle East, with 11,000 soldiers. Since the 9-11 attacks, it has been an essential logistics center for interventions in Afghanistan, Iraq and Syria. bases in the United Kingdom. The twin bases of Lakenheath and Mildenhall in England stand out as key points for operations in the Middle East. A diplomatic incident in 2019, a fatal accident caused by the wife of a CIA agent created tensions between the two countries when she claimed diplomatic immunity to avoid trial in the UK. Each of these bases represents both a strategic pillar and a source of international tension. Their importance to US global power is undeniable, but the controversies they generate also invite a necessary debate protection or imposition. Al-Tanf Base, Syria Located in southern Syria, near the borders with Iraq and Jordan, this base was established in 2015 with a minimal presence of 180 soldiers. Despite its small size, its strategic location is of great importance. Control of Strategic Corridors Al-Tanf is situated on the M2 highway, connecting Iraq and Syria. This location gives the U.S. control over the land corridor used by Iran to send weapons to Hezbollah in Lebanon. Safety Zone Washington has established a 55-kilometer safety zone around the base, effectively blocking this strategic passage for Iran. International rejection. The Syrian government considers the base an illegal occupation, a stance diplomatically supported by Russia and China. Despite this, the U.S. has maintained its presence due to the tactical importance of the base. Guantanamo Bay Naval Base, Cuba The most infamous base of all, Guantanamo is not only one of the first U.S. bases established outside its territory, but also the center of a massive international controversy. Established in 1903 after the Spanish-American War, the U.S. temporarily occupied Cuba and established naval bases there through an agreement with the Cuban government, allowing military base land leasing. The agreement never had an expiration date, which allowed the U.S. to maintain control of the base even after the 1959 Cuban Revolution. After the September 11, 2001 attacks, Guantanamo became a detention center for suspected terrorists. Under George W. Bush's administration, indefinite detention of suspected terrorists was allowed, without trial or access to lawyers, violating normal legal protections. Despite international condemnation, Guantanamo housed hundreds of prisoners, many of whom were tortured or subjected to harsh interrogations. Only 16 prisoners have been charged with crimes and many remain detained without trial. Today, approximately 30 to 40 prisoners remain there, including some of the main perpetrators of the 9-11 attacks.
Diego Garcia Base, Indian Ocean. Diego Garcia Island is a small but vital U.S. military base located in the center of the Indian Ocean. Although geographically isolated, its location is strategic for controlling routes between Asia and the Middle East. It allows the transit of aircraft and ships between the Middle East and Asia, being crucial for strategic bombing in the region. The base hosts aircraft such as the B-52 Stratofortress, B-1B Lancer, and the stealthy B-2 Spirit, all capable of carrying nuclear weapons. Diego Garcia has the capacity to deploy up to 16,000 Marines anywhere in the Indian Ocean, with 4,000 resident soldiers. Originally part of the Chagos Archipelago which belongs to Mauritius, Diego Garcia was leased to the U.S. by the U.K. after Mauritius's independence. The indigenous population was expelled and relocated to Mauritius and Seychelles, a move labeled as a crime against humanity by human rights groups. Although unconfirmed, it is suspected that the U.S. stores nuclear weapons at Diego Garcia, potentially violating the African Nuclear Weapon Free Zone Treaty. Mauritius has repeatedly requested the return of the island, and in 2019, the International Court of Justice ruled that the UK acted illegally in separating the archipelago. However, the US and the UK have ignored these demands, except for Diego Garcia, which remains under US control for the next 100 years. Pine Gap Base, Australia Pine Gap is a joint U.S.-Australian base located in Central Australia, specializing in satellite surveillance and communications. During the Cold War, Pine Gap was used to detect Soviet nuclear missiles. Since the fall of the Soviet Union in 1991, its role has expanded to intercepting communications in Africa, Europe, and Asia. The satellite antennas at Pine Gap allow for large-scale wireless communication interception, including gathering chats, phone calls, and emails, activities revealed by Edward Snowden in 2013. Pine Gap is also crucial for locating predator drones, providing precise coordinates for targeted strikes. During the Afghanistan war it helped eliminate approximately 4,000 Taliban members, though at a high cost in civilian casualties. There are rumors that Pine Gap has been involved in Israeli airstrikes in Gaza in 2024, although this has not been confirmed. If you enjoyed the content, please take a moment to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Your support means the world to us and helps us continue creating exciting videos. Don't forget to follow us on our social media channels, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.